or you can introduce your favorite characters inside the AI town. Yes, this is an AI town, completely AI driven, where these agents are talking to each other powered by Llama 3. So we're going to use O Llama and Llama 3 to do this. And I've got a separate video that exactly tells you how to get this done for your computer. But in this video, I'm going to show you how you can introduce your own character. And as you can see here, I've already introduced a character called Little Coder. This is probably that Little Coder. And what is a profile of Little Coder? One Little Coder is an AI engineer striving to build the next humanity, sorry, the next AGI that can wipe out humanity. Okay, so One Little Coder or Little Coder is right now talking to Kurt and this is the kind of conversation that they're having. So Kurt is talking about artificial intelligence, Little Coder is saying something about it and then Kurt is saying something about it, then Little Coder is saying something about it. Like the more I think about it, the more convinced that AGI will be a game changer. It's not just about super intelligence, it's about unlocking humanity's potential and transcending our limitations. So all Little Coder is trying to do is convert people to believe in AI or AGI and that is the kind of conversation that they are having. How to get this possible? How do you get here is what this video is going to be about. See, uh, after my previous video, a lot of people asked me, how do you basically play this game or a lot of different things? So I'm going to first show you how do you play this game or what is happening here? And then I'm going to show you how to introduce the character. First of all, if you see this, this is an AI town. Like uh, this is a town completely simulated by uh, AI, artificial intelligence, in this case, simply powered by large language models that are running locally using Olama. So we are using Olama to run Llama 3 as a model in the backend. And as you can see here, these agents had a conversation. Now they are going away. So they are, they finished the conversation. They're going to go interact with somebody else as a human in this AI town, you can also go interact with humans or oh, sorry, agents. So this is me, uh, like right now me, and I can go ahead and then interact with somebody. So Stella is there. So I can interact with Stella. Probably what is profile still profile of Stella. Stella can never be trusted. She tries to trick people all the time, normally into giving her money and all the other things. So I can go to somebody and I can talk to them and I can interact with them. Or you can just be a spectator. You can just see what these AI agents are discussing. Right now, it can be just a simple social experiment to see what kind of things happen. But the way you can use this is you can use it. For example, you can make all these agents into like a marketing guy or a sales guy or a sales girl or a developer. And you can see and give all of them a common goal and you can see how they interact within them with this kind of common goal. And as you can see here, probably there is an opportunity for us to chat with Lucky here. Once I accept it, you can see that we have to walk over. Now we have to go to Lucky. Is this Lucky? I don't know. So you can now go to Lucky and then start talking to Lucky. And how are we going to get here? So this is the default setting. You go here, like move your character like this, pointing like this, and then you can go to a particular agent and then start talking to it or you can just see what others are talking. So whenever you see this icon here, so that means they're thinking something, they're doing something, something is happening and you can be part of the conversation virtually, like you can be a spectator. But the most important reason for this video to exist is to introduce your own character. So how are we going to do it? I'm going to just first close this. After I close this, I'm going to stop my current session here. So I'm going to stop my current session as well. Click stop here. After I stop here, you can probably see that you see a new icon called world editor, world editor UI. If you do not have this thing, I would strongly encourage you to first click update here. Once you click update, so the AI town is getting updated by Pinocchio. Pinocchio is downloading the latest version. And after you do that, you can just click world editor UI. And once you do that, you can see certain characters here. So we've got one, two, three, four, five, six, six agents here or six characters here. And you can specify their role and responsibility. So what is their identity and what is their plan? So what is their profile one and what are they trying to do? For example, we have got lucky here. So instead of lucky, I'm going to call somebody unlucky. Okay, so let's call unlucky. That is the first character and unlucky is always, let's say, unlucky is an epitome of sadness and always making others sad and worried about the world being eaten up AGI. You want to 
make people hate AI and AGI. So as you can see here at this point, we have got two characters with contrasting profiles and plans. One is a little coder who is trying to convert everybody to believe AGI so that AGI can wipe out humanity and uh, unlucky is trying to do the opposite. So at this point, you can save this. That means you have successfully saved the profile and close this and then go here and then see if you want to reset the database, you can reset the database as well. And after you have done all these things, you can go ahead once this is completely done, you can go ahead and then start the system. So click start the system and after you click start the system, it is going to help you at this point it is disconnected, then click run here. And it's going to say that you have to install Olama, Olama is already done. And then the next thing is if you run, it is going to run this entire AI town for you with the characters that we have created or with the characters that is already available. And the AI town will be typically run here or you can just wait for it to be up and running. So you can open this particular URL and then you have got the AI town. So you can go ahead and see who is this. Okay, I've got Bob who is daydreaming and you can just like go on, go on, go on and then see, okay, who is this with a carrot? Allies is um, gardening. This is Kurt. Kurt is daydreaming, daydreaming. And then this is unlucky, uh, the character that we introduced. Unlucky is uh, an epitome of sadness and always making others sad and worried. So I can just say interact and uh, you can see um, this is me. I'm trying to probably interact with unlucky. I'm starting a conversation with unlucky. And as you can see here, there is a conversation unlucky. Okay, I'm going to say, hey, um, how are you? That's my question to unlucky. And you can go to the back end and then see what kind of calls are made to Lama 3 as well. The world is doomed and I'm just the messenger AI has already taken over our minds. We are too naive and uh, realize it. Okay, uh, that's uh, that's nice. Okay, I'm going to say, no, no, no. AI is good for humanity. Uh, lot of YouTubers say that. And um, this, is, <laughs> this is what I am telling unlucky. And let's see what unlucky tells me. Hey, those YouTubers are just pawns in the AI game. They're paid to promote its agenda. Wake up sheep. Okay. Uh, See, uh, even Elon Musk loves AGI. Okay, now that is my message to Unlucky. So let's see what Unlucky says. And uh, Unlucky, don't be fooled by his words. He's just a pawn too. Okay, now if you don't like the conversation, you leave the conversation and uh, that's it. Um, the conversation is stored in the history. So whenever you talk to Unlucky, again, Unlucky knows that you spoke this. Um, Unlucky knows who you are and like what kind of profile you have got, what kind of conversation you have. Or you can go peek into others conversation. Bob is grumpy. He loves trees and Kurt is there. So Bob and Kurt are talking. So this is basically how you build these agents and you let them interact in the AI town. While like I said at the start, while this is fun and games at this point, you can use this to see how these agents would behave if you have given them a common goal or if you have created two different teams. I think this is a very good social experiment. I don't know if it is called a social experiment or an agentic experiment. You can do a lot more things. You can introduce more agents and then see how these are talking. We have got a, we have got a conversation we can have with a little coder. So is this little coder? Yeah. Uh, so you can walk. So we, we can go to little coder and then start talking and then see what is, what is little coder doing and uh, little coder is opposite of unlucky. So I think this is going to be extremely useful when you want to simulate a situation to see, okay, there is a bunch of agents talking on or for a topic and a bunch of agents talking against a topic and then see how they are behaving, how they are convincing each other. What are they doing? Um, I think this is extremely useful and it is also fun. Like you can, you can imagine like you have got like kid situation. You can see what the kids are talking or if you want to see how a marketing agency would talk, if you want to see how politicians would talk, I think you can simulate a bunch of things and then see how this would do. Like you can take a, human profile and then give it to an agent and see if the human, the agent is talking like the human. I, I, I like it. I'm kind of obsessed with this AI town at this point. I don't know how many of you are obsessed with this at this point, but this is actually fun. And if you want to see um, your own characters, like I said, at the start of the video, all you have to do is you have to go here and uh, let me stop this current simulation. You have to go here and in the world editor UI, you have to introduce your characters as many you want. Introduce the character name, the character ID, what is their identity and the plan and uh, save it. Restart the game, reset the DB and at this point you should have your own AI agent or the character that you introduced 
into this particular game which is called ai town or a simulated agentic behavior of socially trying to be acceptable characters i don't know how to de define it but uh, let me know in the comment section what you feel see you in another video happy prompting